All right, we've got an interesting project going on in the shop today. This is a 1988 740 turbo Volvo wagon. Has the four cylinder. It is the 2.3 turbo overhead cam. And uh, what we're doing, or I should say the reason why the car came in is it was running rough. And the reason it was running rough was compression on a couple cylinders were really low. And this car is equipped with uh, shim type valves. In other words, there's these little buckets directly underneath the cam. I don't know if you can see that or not. And there's replaceable shims there. Um, as the valves wear, they'll usually go deeper into the head, throws off your valve adjustment, and uh, the valves end up staying open, causing a compression loss. So uh, I'm hoping to bring this car back. Hopefully no valves are burned. Um, and it's kind of a tricky proposition. You got to get those little shims out of there. You use this tool. Um, it's a, just a little hook deal. Uh, it compresses the, the valve springs by using the cam as a fulcrum. And then you can swap out the shims. And the shims come in a little kit like this, all different numbers um, in metric sizes. And then of course you've got to convert by using your handy dandy little tool like that um, to figure out what you need. So the shims look like this, about the size of a 50 cent piece. This one doesn't have any numbers on it. Um, and away you go. It takes a couple hours, but it's kind of an old school thing for what you would think to be a fairly modern car. It does not have hydraulic valve lifters. So there's a tip and trick for your Volvo fans. If it may be running bad, it could be the valves are out of adjustment. This one kind of surprised me. I assumed it had hydraulic valve lifters and that the valves would automatically adjust. But no, it does not. All right, let's get this old girl running. <laughs> 